Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Most Holy Trinity, Father, Son, Holy Ghost, I adore Thee profoundly. I offer Thee the most precious body, blood, soul, and divinity of Jesus Christ present in all the tabernacles of the world in reparation for the outrages, sacrileges, and indifferences by which he is offended, and through the infinite merits of his most sacred heart and of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I beg of thee the conversion of poor sinners. Amen. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love thee. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love Thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love Thee. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love Thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love Thee. Sancti Michael Archangeli, defendenos in prerio, Contra nequitiam et insidias diaboli esto presidium, impedidri Deus supices deprecamur, tuque princeps minitiae celestis, satanam mariosque spiritus malignos, quae perditionem animarum pervagantur in mundo, divine virtute in infern vitrude. Amen. Our Lady of the Rosary, pray for us. On this Sunday, we have the blessing of having a first-class relic of St. Elizabeth Ann Seton right here on this altar. A member of our Rosary Crusade very generously donated this relic, a first-class relic of St. Elizabeth Ann Seton, who is the patron saint of Catholic schools, including every homeschool, because I know many of you are homeschooling your children. And then for those rejected or persecuted for their faith, uh, patron saint of orphans, of widows, and of grief. So let's ask St. Elizabeth Ann Seton to intercede for all of your needs on this day. And at the end, in the little the homily for this day, I'll be speaking primarily about St. Elizabeth Ann Seton. Among the intentions, let's pray especially for those who are sick, including Medardo, who's in need of physical and spiritual healing, but above all, I'd ask you to pray for a family that's representative of the struggles of a lot of families throughout the world. So I'll mention some details on this family because I know them personally, and I know they would not mind this. But this is to give you a window into what so many families are going through in different ways. Uh, it's the Bergen family. And so Jim and Rebecca Bergen, praying very much for you and, uh, and your little girl. And then for the the rest of the Bergen family, they uh, they caught COVID not long ago, and uh, all the family had it. it. Seems like most recovered well. The father of this younger family had to have had to go to have an IV of infusion of antibodies, um, but then seems to have recovered well. However, Teresa, a beautiful young lady, 26 years old who is a special needs uh, young lady and has um, so has had extra suffering all of her life along with a very childlike spirit. Uh, she's always been very childlike and, and joyful in the way that uh, the special needs children and adults usually are. But Teresa with COVID, her lungs, they, um, they tried to assist her lungs with uh, by intubating her and her lungs collapsed unfortunately and so she passed from this life so to please pray for the bergen family as they're grieving over the loss of their dear daughter i think among all those on the earth those who still have the innocence of children which it seems like uh, teresa had uh, being a special needs young lady also all the sufferings she had and then being raised in a very devout family i think she has about the best chance of anyone of going quickly to heaven nonetheless i'll pray for and ask you to pray for the repose of her soul and again for the consolation of her family and for many families throughout the world who are struggling or grieving for the loss of loved ones right now 
So let us pray for them and enter now into this minute of silence. But first, praying the prayer that I will have us pray daily, the prayer given to St. Gertrude for the poor souls in purgatory, also so that they might intercede, the poor souls in purgatory, for the, the very unjust attack on the holy sacrifice of the Mass taking place in the Church now. Eternal Father, we offer you the most precious body and blood, soul and divinity of your divine Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in union with all the holy Masses which are said throughout the world. For all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my own family. Amen. Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Ghost, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Punctius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day He rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence He shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Ghost, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection of our Lord from the dead, we ask for the fruit of the mystery, faith. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. The second glorious mystery, the ascension of our Lord into heaven, we ask for the fruit of the mystery, hope. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Ghost upon the apostles and the Blessed Virgin Mary. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, zeal for the salvation of souls. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. The fourth glorious mystery, the assumption of Our Lady into heaven, we ask for the fruit of the mystery, true devotion to Mary. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. The fifth glorious mystery, the crowning of Our Lady, Queen of Heaven and Earth. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, the grace of final perseverance. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. O Immaculate Heart of Mary, you are the Holy Mother of God and our tender Mother. Look upon the distress in which the Church and the whole of humanity are living because of the spread of materialism and the persecution of the Church. In Fatima, you warned against these errors as you spoke about the errors of Russia. You are the Mediatrix of all graces. Implore your Divine Son to grant this special grace for the Pope that he might consecrate Russia to your Immaculate Heart so that Russia will be converted a period of peace will be granted to the world, and your Immaculate Heart will triumph through an authentic renewal of the Church, in the splendor of the purity of the Catholic faith, of the sacredness of divine worship, and of the holiness of the Christian life. O Queen of the Holy Rosary and our sweet Mother, turn your merciful eyes to us, and graciously hear this, our trusting prayer. Amen. Mm -hmm. Salve Regina, Mater Misericordiae, Vita Dulce, Do Bet Spes Nostra Salve, Ante Clamamus Exules Filii Geve, Ante Suspiramus Cementes et Flentes, in ac lacrimarum vale. Ea ego advocata nostra, illos tuos misericordes oculos ad nos converte. Et Iesum benedictum fructum ventris tui, nobis post hoc exiligum ostende. O clemens, O pia, Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. 
O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. And may Almighty God, through the intercession of the Immaculate Heart of the Blessed Virgin Mary, pour out His graces upon each one of your families. Benedictio de Omnipotentis, Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti, descendat super vos et maniat semper. Amen. And so now, for those who are able to, I'll say a few words about the readings for today, and especially about Elizabeth Ann Seton, St. Elizabeth Ann Seton, whose first-class relic we have here, and so whose intercession we surely have even more strongly today. The first reading comes from the letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians. Brethren, I recall to your minds the gospel that I preached to you, which also you received, wherein also you stand, through which also you are being saved, if you hold it fast, as I preached it to you, unless you have believed to no purpose. For I delivered to you first of all what I also received, that Christ died for our sins according to the Scriptures, and that He was buried, and that He rose again the third day according to the Scriptures, and that He appeared to Cephas, and after that to the eleven, then he was seen by more than 500 brethren at one time, many of whom are still with us. But some have fallen asleep. After that he was seen by James, then by the apostles. And last of all, as one born out of due time, he was seen also by me. For I am the least of the apostles, and am not worthy to be called an apostle, because I persecuted the church of God. But by the grace of God, I am what I am, and His grace in me has not been fruitless. St. Paul declares here, I delivered to you first of all what I also received. It speaks of the gospel which you received. St. Paul recalls that the entire Catholic faith, the divine faith that God gave to this world, is consists in receiving from Jesus Christ through the apostles, through their successors, receiving what has been handed down by tradition and passing that on to those after us. Our entire faith is based on tradition, that is, on receiving what's been handed on to us, the saving truth of Jesus Christ. And that's one reason why the holy sacrifice of the Mass in the traditional form is so important, what's often described as the Latin Mass. The traditional form of the Mass puts you in direct contact with your ancestors, with the saints. For example, St. Elizabeth Ann Seton, this was the Mass that led her to convert from being a Protestant to a Catholic to becoming a saint. St. Elizabeth Ann Seton uh, grew up in 18th century New York, so right as, right as America was becoming a country, she grew up in New York City. And as a young girl, she apparently loved dancing and theater. And she especially liked to read, particularly the Bible, and had a fiery temper that she later learned to control, but apparently had quite a temper as a girl. And she loved, in particular, praying and reading the Bible. And she lost both her mother and her baby sister when she was just three or four years old. And that, no doubt, helped her already turn her eyes towards heaven as she grew up thinking that, hoping that her mother uh, and sister were in heaven. And then she got married in 1794, so just after the American Revolution, just very shortly after uh, the U.S. had become a country. She was born in seven. 1974. So she lived through the U.S. becoming a separate country. And th then her husband would die not that long thereafter. They first had a number of children, 
uh, had five children, and then uh, her husband became ill and passed away while they were on a visit to Italy. So while in Italy, uh, St. Elizabeth Ann Seton began learning about the Catholic faith, which she had not, seems, known much at all. And then when she returned to the U.S., she uh, was strongly inclined or inclined to become a Catholic. And there followed a year in which her, um, her Protestant friends and family were violently opposed to her becoming a Catholic. And on the other hand, uh, her, her mind and heart was realizing this is the truth. And so it was a very painful year. That's one reason why she's the patron saint of those who are rejected or persecuted for their faith, because at that time, there was a great deal of anti-Catholicism, um, in which we may be very quickly heading into that same domain today in this country and other countries. And so she she overcame that. She overcame the fierce opposition. She became a Catholic. Uh, I don't want to make this too long, so I should speed up. She uh, embraced the faith and then went on to hand on the faith, not only to her children, but she was invited to start a school along with, I think it was two other women at the beginning who were with her in, uh, in Maryland. And so she began a school and then uh, made vows, received permission, even though she had children, she was a widow, received permission to make vows as a sister with these other women and founded a religious order. And that she became Mother Seton. And so she's unique in that she has both, was a mother with raising her children and then the founders of a religious order as a nun. And her whole life was dedicated then to passing on the truths of the Catholic faith, uh, to passing on the unchanging truths that nothing and no one in this world can change that comes down to us from Jesus Christ. And that's only a very brief description of her life. The last thing I'll finish with is that she had a very strong devotion to the will of God, to surrendering to God's will. She experienced in her life many very painful things, of the loss of her mother at a young age, the loss of her husband, and over and over again she surrendered to the will of God, saying, Thy will be done. And her favorite prayer, we're told, was this psalm, which I'll pray for you right now. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Yes, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. May St. Elizabeth Ann Seton obtain for us a love of the truths of the faith that have been handed on to us, a love of tradition, and also a great trust in God's will, surrender to God's will. God bless each one of you. Have a wonderful Sunday with your family.